So I'm going to play for you guys an old clip of a young Paul Washer who pretty much explains in a hilarious fashion how one time early on in his ministry, he was actually called out by someone in this church for teaching heresy. Now, even though the clip is funny, the reason I'm actually showing it is because it's a real issue and a real problem. And I do talk with godly men on platforms like YouTube and Twitter that have to deal with this at their local church. Leaders in the church getting mad at sound biblical truth. So some of you have asked what you should do if the leadership at your church is just flat out unbiblical. And I plan to make a video to address that situation. I was teaching years ago to a youth group. This was probably 20 some years ago. And I got up and I preached and there was a, 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 the youth leader got up and accused me of heresy and ran out the door. And I'm thinking, oh, I've done it now. I didn't even know what I did. And so the pastor called a meeting with me. I go in there, fear and trembling. The youth director's there. The pastor's there. And the pastor goes, okay, Brother Paul, there's been a charge of false teaching against you. And I said, oh, okay. And he said, okay, please tell us what Brother Paul said. The youth director got up and he went like this. Baptist church. Youth director gets up and he goes, Pastor, you're not going to believe this. Brother Paul, now I love him, but Brother Paul said that Jesus was God. And the pastor goes, uh, He is God. <laughs> 